Before this video starts, I just want to give a massive shout out to all my channel members. If you want to receive a shout out, then become a channel member today and you'll be shown on screen like all these other channel members here. Anyways, enjoy the video. The Battle Cats is a mobile game that I hold in high regard as it's one of the few mobile games out there that are still being updated that are genuinely fun to play. Today, I want to share 50 random facts about this amazing game, from the obvious to the obscure. Most of the facts in here are probably not going to be of any real use in getting better at the game, but it's still fun to learn the small details of this strange world of cats. If you want even more facts that are already released, check the card in the corner of the video. If you enjoyed watching this video, why not give it a like? Maybe leave a comment down below on what fact was interesting to you or what facts you know about the game. If you enjoy the content on this channel, why not hit that subscribe button since an astounding 76% of people that actually watch my videos are not subscribed and it would be very appreciated if you could subscribe. Also, I have a link to my Discord server in the description down below that you can join and talk with others in my community as well as myself. Anyways, to the facts we go. As of version 13.4, there have been 5 sage enemies added. 4 out of the 5 have a clear basis on real life historical people. Sage of Mind Soractes is based on the ancient Greek philosopher Socrates. Dogenstein is based on the theoretical physicist Albert Einstein. Dark Dober is based on Czech composer Antonin Dvorak. And Darker K.O. is based on political theorist Karl Marx. Crocodile de Kurokroc and Zrako are mistaken to be alligators in their enemy descriptions despite being crocodiles. Just to add on to this fact, you can tell the difference between an alligator and a crocodile depending on the shape of their snouts, as gators have U-shaped snouts while crocs have V-shaped snouts. There are a few other differences, such as the visibility of the bottom teeth and the color of their skin. If the player is on an outdated version of the Battle Cats, the only set that will be available is the Tales of Nekaluga, unless it's in a version where not all of the Lugas are present. The Mysterious Calamity has the current highest money drop in the game. With everything related to accounting maxed out, they have a money drop of 43,904 cents. In the Japanese version of the Battle Cats, Zamboni Cat is referred to as a cleaning robot, like a Roomba, while in the English version, their name is a reference to the Zamboni, a company that specializes and is a common name used to describe an ice resurfacer. Prior to version 13.0, all of the malevolent stages had lower health on the enemy base. On screen is the amount of HP each base had, but they have all been changed to have 2.5 million health in the update. Sayaka Miki, a collab uber from the Madoka Magica collab, was given knockback immunity in version 10.9. If you were to count the Relic Bear featured in Nyanko Defense Force, a defunct Battle Cat spin-off, then Teacher Bear has at least one variant of each trait. Floating an Angel comes from the Bears Be Back enemy. In the Battle Cat's Pop, the 3DS version of the game, Fortune Teller Cat is called Mystic Cat. In Kumanchu Royale, a now defunct sequel to the original Flip Phone Battle Cats, Missile Bear, the Cow Cat equivalent of this game, would have a kamikaze ability similar to that of Glass and Rock Cat. Gacha Cat and Principal Cat are the only two units in the game that have a positive stat reduction, meaning that instead of gaining less stats after a specific level, they gain more stats after a certain level. In the Battle Cats Unite, Eskimo Nebula's name was changed to Cat 2392. This is a reference to the actual Nebula's designation, which is Nebula 2392, and was also probably done to avoid controversy as the term Eskimo was considered offensive to many members of various indigenous groups, such as the Inuit, the Yupak, and the Aleut. Kraze Maneko, Kraze Princess Punt, and Kraze Yuki are the only Kraze units who still retain the aura seen on Kraze enemies. Windy and Thundia's true forms share the exact same attack and health stats. They also both gain Strengthen and Curse immunity talents. The Mysterious Force and the Turbo Machine are the only treasures that require one stage treasure to activate. The River City Challenge stages have the highest enemy limit out of any stage, having an enemy limit of 100. Mighty Aegis Garu was the first unit add to have the mini wave ability. Every stage's name featured in Theater of Fear is a reference to a horror movie. Spiraling Ring is a reference to Ring and its sequel, Spiral. Payday the 13th is a reference to Friday the 13th. Normal Activity is a reference to Paranormal Activity, Darkened House is a reference to Black House, and Internal Scream is a reference to Scream. A Pile of Guts' name was lost in translation, but is a reference to the Evil Dead. The Japanese name for this stage is Harawata no Shirio Shitsu, meaning Gut Archives, and the Japanese name for the Evil Dead is Shirio no Harawata, which means Guts of Spirits. The Iron Legion and Elemental Pixies are the only regular sets to not have any of the units in each set to have a seasonal variant. In the Easter Island Aku Realm stage, the Condemned Pangs used to be at 400% and the Cerberus Kids used to be at 500% magnifications. This was changed at an unknown date and now both of the Pangs and Cerberus Kids are at 300% magnification. The base in the Thailand stage is the Waprakyao, which is considered the most sacred Buddhist temple in Thailand. 
Extra Life Cat is a reference to Super Mario, as both share similar color palettes with their clothing, and the fact that 1-Up Mushrooms, a power-up in the Mario franchise, give the player an extra life. Ultimate Bondage Cat, Can Can Cat, Rampage Cats, Madame the Savannah, Iron Claw X, and Curling Cat were all given warp immunity in version 6.5. Boogie Cat's afro was actually a wig, revealing a small bald cat when knocked back. If an enemy's damage is zero, then the damage dealt sound will not play. This can be best observed in Gua Ghouls when the Angel Fanboys attack. Regular Whale Cat is a Tooth Whale, while Lil Whale Cat is a Baleen Whale. Rain D may actually be a person wearing a reindeer costume, at least according to the Japanese description. Urun and Urs are the only enemy legend cats that have less range than their unit counterparts. Enemy Urun has 415 range, while the unit has 440, and enemy Urs has 300, while the unit has 445. Though for Urs, the enemy has an Omni Strike that goes up to 500. Prior to version 11.1, .1, the Sorrels on Heron's Call respawned infinitely. Before they were added, Stone Cat was a placeholder unit that was a special unit and used the basic cat sprites as a placeholder. Sorectis' name comes from a combination of the Japanese word Sora, meaning sky or the air, and Socrates. The Sora part references the enemy counterpart's floating trait. At some point before the current English version was released, Maneko used to have a recharge time of 9,999 frames, or around 5 minutes and 33 seconds, and wasn't able to deal critical hits. Prior to version 4.7, the Liver Trouble combo used to be a free small combo, boosting the freeze duration by 10%. It is now a Cat Cannon power-up small combo. Black Zeus and Akuma are the only two Legend Rares that produce a normal soul upon death. However, this could be explained by the fact that they are collab units. Akugori's Japanese description references the comedian's dark business problem scandal in which comedians lost their jobs for attending Yakuza parties. Akugori resurfacing as an online streamer references Hiroyuki Miyasako, who was involved with the scandal and has since made a comeback as a YouTuber with the channel having more than 1 million subscribers. The main gimmick of the Girls and Monsters set is that every single unit has a multi-hit. Four of them have two attacks, while five of them have three attacks. Prior to February 2018, no Plan A didn't have a known schedule. Both Gummy Cat and Wafer Cat are units added to promote Battle Cat's themed gummies and wafers. Cutie Momoko has different saucers in her upgrade icon compared to her actual saucers. These saucers are more rounded, lack any lines going through the saucer, and the stars on the saucers are replaced with hearts. The origins of all the Colossus enemies are from the Laboratory of Relics, the same one in which the Eldritch Forces stages takes place. Despite appearing only in the Japanese version, English file names for the Google Android collaboration stages exist within the game files. The Gates of Aku is the only event stage that has no time limit. Several 4 Koma comics reveal that along with the main cat, there are also three other cats inside the Kotatsu of Kotatsu Cat. The Haka of Miss Haka's name just means grave or tomb in Japanese, so her name is technically Miss Grave. The removed cat combos, Just Us League and Revengers, are references to the Justice League and the Avengers respectively. Zyklone has the lowest DPS and raw damage out of any Cyclone enemy. According to Suede Pigagus' description, they are the pet of Elizabeth the 56th. Angel enemies were added to the Battle Cats during version 2.7. The English version of the Battle Cats is the only version that has not received the Gudetama collab. And finally, Diverse City has the highest drop rate of sprockets out of any chapter, having a 25% chance to drop them in any stage. I want to thank you all for watching. If you thought these facts were fascinating, why not give this video a like and maybe even subscribe if you enjoy the content on this channel and hit the bell so you don't miss an upload, as well as comment down below what fact was most interesting to you. Also, shout out to the following channel members, Potato King, Something Something YouTube, and Athani for being silver members or higher. Become a channel member today as it's a way to support me in a way that helps keep the lights on, and channel members receive an exclusive role in my Discord server, for which you can find a link to in the description down below. Anyways, I hope you have a wonderful day.